Aries, what's poppin' Aries? How y'all doing? The song that's playing for you is uh, Heating Up. It's, get, it's at the end, though. So you might be getting out of a high intense situation where it was like high emotions, high feelings, high thoughts, high ideas being shared, whether it was, it was in an altercation or just in conversation, you feel me? Something that, that was involving high feelings, high how you felt about something or how you felt about someone else. High emotions. Now it's like racks too skinny. Now you either be you may be losing money because of you getting out of you trying to get out of this situation, or somebody losing something. You feel me? Something getting smaller. Boo, you 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 this is the one. That's you. You took you working on something, or you were working on something, now you take a break to look at it. Okay, you trying to make sure you ain't gonna lose if you continue to work on this. Whether it's losing time, whether it's losing money, whether it's losing energy. You're taking a break to look at something from an ink from a different perspective. Whether that and it's like something you've been invested in. And see, look, you're trying to see if this is worth continuing. I don't know what I know. I ain't seen what I seen. What the fuck they be talking about? Yeah. The cock out. Open the end of my jaw. She thought I was pulling my cock out. Get popped down. No one of us. I do not trust you, Dan, especially not now. What you looking at though, Eric? This could be a relationship you've been invested in for a while. You, you've been in you've been in this relationship for about seven years. Now you look at the seven months, seven days, seven weeks, seven hours. You probably just met somebody and you look, see, you're trying to determine if this is worth the investment, if this is worth continuing, you feel me? Because you don't know Queen of Wands in reverse. You don't know if this is what you actually want, all right? You don't know if this person is the Queen of Wands. You think this person is the Queen of Wands in reverse type shit, you, but you, it's like, do you want to risk it? You want to roll this dice or not? They could be the queen of wands in reverse. They could be the queen of wands upright. This job can help you or this job can break you. It could take your time. Look, but you might you might go ahead on that trip, though. You feel me? You might take that adventure because that's what that's how you feeling. You feeling because you, you, you feel like it might bring you justice. OK, bring balance to your reality. Justice in the sense of balance, justice in the sense of peace, whatever justice is to you. You feel me? You're looking at something, okay? It's something you worked on, whether it's a job you at now, a job you left because of because of some type of situation, or just a relationship you left, a relationship you are in, and you're trying to determine. It's like now nah, you gained all this knowledge from working on it. You feel me? You gained different knowledge from being in it. Now you're stepping outside of it and looking at it and trying to determine if the, if this is something I want to continue to water or do I want to go on a new quest or is this, or do I just want to keep working on what I've been manifesting? You feel me? Because it's like, see, page of wands, it's something new for you. Something you're doing is something you haven't done before. And you're trying to determine, it's like, I have all the wisdom. I have all the thoughts. I have all the ideas. I have all the knowledge on how I want to approach this situation. It's like you right now, you're trying to determine if you, if you want to approach it, period. But it's looking like you might just go ahead and roll that dice. You feel me? If it's a relationship, then let it be a relationship. It's like you looking at somebody you've known for a while, somebody from your childhood, past, it, somebody you in school with now, or you used to go to school with, and you trying to determine if they like I've known you for a very long time. Should I invest in you? But it, it's looking like you might go ahead and make that investment, though. That's what it's looking like. Whatever it is, you've spent time in it. It's not something new. It's something that you've worked on or you've put hours in, put energy in. You feel me? You're just trying to determine if it's worth continuing to invest in. But it seems like you've, you've made that decision to continue to invest in a way of being, a way of thinking, a way of walking, a way of talking. Whatever it is, you see, look, you made a wish upon a star. Whether the, and you feel like this will heal you. Now, not how it feels. You feel me? You're trying to figure. That's the song that's playing. So it's like you're trying to figure out how something makes you feel. You feel when you look at it, when you think about it, to determine if you still got the passion for it to continue. But it's looking like you still got the passion. See, you leaning on the wand, and then the wand you was leaning on, you you use it as a foundation. You feel me? Like yes, I'm gonna use this. Now you now you feel you got two more passionate perspectives. Like this is the this one is the first one when you initially got the idea. So if this was a person, this is when you first met the person. You feel me? You first met the person, you put time into it. You put time into it, boom. You you put seven months, seven days, seven hours, seven weeks, just energy. 
and you manifested thoughts, feelings, and different ideas, different perspectives on how you view this overall topic. Then after that, you took a break. Boom. Now you think this one you're leaning on is like another fire. How you you looking at it, how you feel. You're trying to determine how you feel about this bush. How you feel about this person. How you feel about this job I've been working at. How you feel about this friendship, this relationship, this partnership. You feel me? How I feel about this business plan. Boom. Now that you figure that out, that's the second one. See, this was the, this one's when you got the idea. This is after you've been working on the idea. Now you're looking at it. That, that one right there. Now it's like you get now it almost once you took a break to look at it, it relit your fire. And now you want to continue to work on it. That's what it's looking like, because you feel like this will heal you. You feel like this will nurture you. This You feel like this will help your spirit grow, help your help your reality progress in a, in some way, shape or form. Five, five, five. When I'm talking. Aries. Someone that's playing is, yeah, how it feels. You just have to make sure you knew how it made you feel first. There you go. Overall, oh, overall, it's like something you is now. This that's the overall energy. So it's something you fighting for. It's like you fighting for your what's the word I'm looking for? Success, almost, or fighting for your accomplishments, fighting for something, and you you trying to hit that shit quick. I'm telling you. Now this could be how people feel outside of the situation, because this is this is how you rock. You feel me? It's the overall energy. So it's like conflict. People may be trying to fight you over a decision you made, or people may be trying to bring drama towards your space because of you 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 decided you want to keep manifesting this, or you decided you want to go a different route. You looked at something you were working on. You did. You might have been like, "This isn't something I want to continue to work on. I want to go in a new direction." Now you're going in a new direction, but everybody that was invested in what you were previous, like everybody that was with you on this, they're like, hold, hold, hold on. You can't just switch up like that. Even though you don't know what's in store, you're still ready to go because you realize this is something I don't want to work on. So now people fighting because of that. People fighting, trying to fight you. People fighting each other because it's like, whoa, he's the reason. She's the reason this was working in the first place. Now he or she doesn't want to work on it. Everybody fighting type shit. Or it's like you fighting to obtain or you fighting to continue to manifest this bush. All right. There's two two ways you can flip it. It's either you fighting to uh, manifest something and it's like you willing to cut tooth and nail for this. You're not going to let nobody tell you something or try to tell you shit about what you're trying to manifest. Or people are fighting you because you're not manifesting with them or you leaving them behind in order to focus on what you actually want in your life. You leaving people, places and things behind that don't resonate with what you're trying to achieve, what you're trying to the goals you set for yourself. People, people fighting you because it's like, hey, man, you don't fuck with us like you used to fuck with us. Hey, bro, why are you acting like this? Why are you walking like this? Why are you talking like this? You feel me? Why are you being this way? You, you, because you looked at how you used to be and you realized this isn't manifesting the life I want. I need to go in a new direction. You feel me? Different ways you could turn it. But it, look, it looks like you're trying to progress in life there, uh, Aries. And it probably maybe because you had to, you probably had to break up with something with the lovers in reverse. Whether you had to break up with a way of being, a habit, a person. You looked at that habit and you realized this isn't going to help me manifest. This isn't going to help me grow. I got to go in a new direction. I got to be different. I got to think different. I got to move different. Talk to different people. Hang with different friends. Find new associates. And that's bringing conflict to everybody you're leaving behind. That's bringing conflict to the personality that you drop. And it's like in your head, it's like, yo, you still get tempted to be this way. You still, it's like the devil keep throwing bones at you mentally. Like, hey, yo, remember when you used to do that and how you act like this? And it's bringing some mental conflict because you're trying to grow. Hey, you again, flip it any highway it go. I'm going to fuck with you though, Aries. Hey.